YouTube, what's going on? Justin Skaggs here from Style and Strings Across. Today we're going to tackle the problem of frayed and tattered top strings. This is Stick Tech. I give speeches all over the country and one of the most common things I find, especially in youth players, is that their top strings are completely torn apart. Now I've taken my personal game stick, this is an old one, it's not the one I'm currently using, and I have actually destroyed my own top string so I can show you guys how to repair it. This is a really, really old technique that I learned back in high school, and we've actually made a video like this before, but I figured since camera technology got better, we might as well revisit it. What we're going to do is we're going to take clear nail polish, and we are going to repair the top string on a lacrosse stick. Having your stick worn down is usually the cause of playing on really rough turf and or practicing out on the concrete. So the first thing I would say is avoid practicing on the concrete. You can also avoid this problem by putting some duct tape or athletic tape in your bag and running a line of that over the top of the lip whenever you are going to be playing out in such elements. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to burn away all the loose ends, all of the fuzzy stuff and the straight strings. The reason for this is if we're going to put the nail polish on top of that, it's just going to get all globbed up and what we want to do is protect the stuff that's still good. So we're going to basically get rid of the dead weight and start from there. If your string is already 50% worn away, you're unfortunately going to have to keep all that frayed nonsense out of risk of burning straight to the string and blowing out your top string. Today we are going to be using uh, LA Colors. Uh, I got it down the street for three bucks and pretty much any clear nail polish will do. Do not get the colored nail polish. This stuff is basically just a lacquer or a glue that comes with an applicator. So it's not actually the same stuff as regular nail polish. This is for protective coatings on the outside, which is exactly what we're trying to put on this top string. What I would suggest is three even applications. After that, you can always go back and add more. As you play with this, you're going to notice that the nail polish is starting to wear away instead of your string. So keep it in your bag and keep applying it as, as it continues to wear away in a row. This is definitely something to keep in your bag. Probably put it in a plastic bag in case the glass bottle breaks. Trust me, I know from experience. But this will stop your top string from blowing out and making you have to use your uh, secondary stick or borrow a stick from somebody which nobody likes. The next time, guys, put your uh, comments and ideas for new stick tech in the comment section below. Take care. Keep laughing.